So what happened Saturday night? So so Ray, so Ray, uh, Ray, you contacted Teamster Tim and said I ain't gonna have a place to stay, or or Teamster Tim knew that. Um, I, I contact. No, he didn't know it. I thought I had a place to stay. We we went through this today on the BS show. I'll go through. Yeah, it. I know. Okay, but, this, okay. Okay, but, there, but people who are watching now didn't watch the BS show. You think? And now everyone just sits around watch a shitty podcast all day. So what the fuck happened? So so teams and Tim said you can stay here, and then and then and then you said you had to get a hotel, but 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 so that wasn't entirely the truth, right? You teams and Tim offered you uh, the no, couch. No, wrong. No. He I'm called. A, he, he, yeah, well, Ray, I'm going to tell the truth, you fucking idiot. Fucking, he called me at 12:30. I had a suite, right? So, like I told you, he came over. He realized that the, the the couch opened up into a bed. It was perfect. I had my own room. I went to bed. Kev, I worked 15 hour shifts a night. What do you think I want to do? Hobnob down in fucking Pottstown all night? <laughs> I'm tired, man. So it's no big deal, man. But I just, I, like I said, I was in a win by two chat and somebody asked me, oh, did he stay in your room? I go, no, he stayed in the same hotel. So, all right, a little white lie. You, you caught me. You fucking, what's the big deal, man? It, you know, and Ray, you're getting yeah, all you, 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 No, you, you asked but, me to not mention that I, you said I got my own room. If anyone asked, I didn't stay with you. I got my own room. So therefore, I people like, well, hey, they said you're carrying blankets around, these pink blankets around, which are my bed sheets that right? I was using to crash on the couch. But at the same time, what? you're my buddy. You hooked me up. People are asking because everyone's what? like, oh, you had these pink bed sheets. What, 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 what did you? Wait, uh, Tim, you got to let him talk. Tim, you got to let him talk. If two people can't talk at once. So wait, Ray, you're kind of around pink uh, sheets? It's my bed sheets. I got a, I got a comforter. Yeah, it's pink. My and you brought them pink. to the show? No, I. They're, they were in the trunk of my car. And then <laughs> I brought them to the fucking... They're in my car, and I uh, was getting my sheets out of my car so I could fucking sleep on the pullout bed. And Tim was like, just don't say, say you got your own room. You didn't crash here. I was like, okay. So I'm like, because of that, I'm not going to say I crashed with Tim. I got my own room. People are like, I didn't you- say that that night, Raymond. Well, I didn't well, say a word uh, about well, it. Whatever, but this is after the fact. So then today, everyone's asking me, why are you walking around the hotel with pink sheets? What are you, stealing bed sheets? What are you, stealing bed sheets? And that's when I text him, like, Bob, let's no, cross this. That, okay, you know why I can't talk about this. Okay, no. wait, you know wait, 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 wait. Let me say my shit before you get into your shit. No, how, did, how do people know you're a kid? Can I ask one question? Can I ask one? I think it's my show. Can I ask one question and then I'll drop off the show? Shut the fuck up. Uh, Ray, how did people know about your infamous pink sheets? I think because, um, Cardiff mentioned that I had, that, uh, I was walking around the hotel with, we had breakfast uh, with him, Kevin. He was yeah. sitting right across during breakfast. And then no Carlos, who does all my podcasts, like, Hey, what's up with these pink sheets you're t- carrying around? What's up with these pink sheets? What are you taking, uh, stuff from hotel rooms? And I was like, that's why I told him, I'm like, listen, dude, I can't talk about this. This is why I can't talk about it. For fucking, <laughs> I don't respect for Team Sir Tim. I'm like, all right, I got my own room. What respect to me giving, Ray? You asked me. me. You, you guys, Tim, 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 you got to wait till Ray finish. You can't talk over each other. Because Nobody hears lying. anything. He's fucking okay, lying. let him lie and then, then chalk him in. You can't talk at once. Ever, no okay. one can hear anything. I drive trucks, Kev. I know that's why I'm telling you. If you're I was aggra- coming in truck, I would expect you to you're give fucking, me some tips. You're aggravating me, man. You're fucking aggravating me. Let him finish, and then you tell your side. Yeah. So I, I wasn't saying that. I, I was saying, yeah, I got my own hotel room. Out of respect for Tim, because Tim asked me to. All right, let Tim talk. Ray, when you called me, I got you came over. I opened the door. You you got on the couch. I went to bed. We did not speak about your lodgings or anything like that. The next day when I was yeah. driving home, I seen the fucking notification for win by two. So I was excited to watch it, to hear about the show. When I watched it, I commented, somebody in the chat asked me if I fucking, if you stayed in my room, I said, no, he, he stayed in the same hotel. One of these fucking Columbos had to go behind the scenes and find out that he did stay in my room. What's the big deal? We had breakfast with Cardiff. We had breakfast with KB and we had breakfast with, uh, Cardiff, uh, Cardiff's wife. So yeah. one of them might have seen you carrying your shit to your car. It's that simple. 
Why are you making a fucking federal case out of it? It's no big deal, dude. Yeah. Because I didn't want, because you asked me not to say, not to let it be known that I stayed in in your. But that yeah, was your, after the fact. Yeah, yeah. That so was that was why, the day after. So that's why I was saying. That's why I, was saying, I already had said it. I said it on win right. by two. All right. So well, I, I, I didn't know that. I um. But yeah, I sent Levy a picture of the text you sent me. I'm like, listen, dude, just a heads up. Please don't say I crashed it. Just say I got I my didn't. own room. I didn't. Yeah. All right. But then I also, didn't. So it was a white line that got out of hand. No, so they would bring it up. Like, Why are you carrying around? Red? Yeah, yeah. No, I, I thought it was which in I your got car. From the trunk I had of my car. Which I it had was. no idea where it was from. It just like you got really weird when they said a pink blanket. You just totally went blank on, on air. And which I, had to come from Cardiff because it what didn't come from me and it didn't come from the girl I was with. Yeah, it's, it's, so, it's all good. So it's no big deal. It's just a throwaway <laughs> comment, right? Whoa, whoa, wow, you got pink sheets. Who gives a fuck? Are they warm? I don't give Did a shit. Want? I exactly. was just can I ask you another question? I know it's not my show, but can I ask another question? Do you have a, is he has pink sheets and a pink blanket? No, it's no, just like a, just it's a, like a, pink, it's like a blanket. It's a pink Who comforter. gives a fuck? It's a pink comforter. All right, so no pink sheets, just a pink blanket. Yeah, yeah. whatever. All right, that's pretty manly, though. Listen, <laughs> I don't really, I don't really I don't care, know, but but I don't know how this got so convoluted. Is uh, I have no idea. Over one little thing that I said in the chat, I'm like, somebody asked me, did Ray stay in your room? I go, no, he stayed in the same hotel. Then all of a sudden, like, there's all these detectives. So you just, like, did you say that so because you don't want to come off as a piazza, or you just did it because? No, I just, I don't well, we know. Had, I we had sex. We definitely had sex. No, we well, didn't. It seemed like you had sex. It wasn't a piazza. It was definitely sex. I was with a female in the morning, Ray. You no, Ray. Uh, I know. Why I'm fucking around. And, and by the way, Ray, hey, Kev, one more thing before. Ray, you owe me a fucking apology. And no, Tim, it, Tim, but why? You why me ugly in front of that girl. No, why did you say? Uh, why did you I was say a in, joke, you son of a bitch. You're not ugly. You're handsome. Jesus. Tim, Tim, initially, why did you say he didn't stay in your room? Why Why were you caught? Why were you? Oh, no, I just, it was just a throwaway comment. You know, I just didn't, because he stays at my house. I didn't want it to look like, you know. Fucking you got, like with best clothes. Dude wears my clothes. I gave him the bad news bad shirt, man. Oh. He was wearing my clothes. He's sleeping on my couch. I'm, he's got him in hotel rooms. I should claim the guy in my taxes, man. <laughs> but I just I love Ray though. I love Ray. He's my friend. It's not a big deal. No, it's that's what I'm saying. Deal. It was like when it Ray went comes from, to town, he can stay in my house anytime. But it went you from know, him spending two hundred dollars on a room to like I didn't know where it was going. I was like, all right, I'll pay it then. I mean, I have no idea. It I was listening to you the other night say you got your own room, you paid for it, it wasn't worth the gig because you had to pay for a hotel room, which never happened. I was gonna buy a hotel room if I didn't get to crash with him. Yeah, and if I would have had, to... <laughs> I told you, you I didn't gonna... want any money. I said that to you. I said that. I you said, said don't it worry on about your it, show, Ray. You said, said it that... on your show. I had no, I had no idea what happened after I left. You were on your show, I guess Sunday night, saying by paying for the hotel room and everything, it wasn't worth it, and. And, and you said you paid for a hotel room, and I said I'll take I'll take care of it. And then I text, and then you don't te- worry send about me a it, text. Dude. That's don't. when I text you, and I said, "Don't worry, I crashed on the pullout couch in at Timster uh, Teams uh, place." Teams. <laughs> Teams. <laughs> at, at, T- at Tim's I place, I, uh... I said, "I'm cool." And then I said, "Just don't mention that I crashed there." And he I didn't. Want people I know. didn't. So that's it. So why are you doing all this shit? What am I doing? What shit did I do? I, I like did nothing. Somehow, I'm the one that got fucked over, and yet I'm the one that's somehow guilty of this shit. Wait, yeah, you I didn't get fucked over, Ray. Fucked over, right? Ray, we've you, been talking about you. You that's, fucking that's the end of the game. You fucking. You told idiot. me don't talk you want about, to talk about you. him in the. You you got a room with him. That was after I was offering to pay you. You said you don't have. You said on your and show. And what I you said, said, I said you don't have to. And then I text you. It's cool, dude. I yeah. crashed said team sure. And what did I say? What the and fuck I is said, this just, about? I was like, what the fuck? Why would you go out of your way to make up something crazy and saying he you didn't, he didn't want me to say? I, Bob, I did. It was me. I I was in a win by two chat, and once I once I said that in the chat, I texted Ray. Hey Ray, don't say that you that you stay with me. Say you got your own room. So I told that's him. That's why I that. fucking said that. 
Okay. So it's okay, my little then, white lie. But that's it. That's as far as it goes. That That's it. You know, I mean. But it, it went from it that night, him paying for a hotel room, saying it wasn't worth it. All the reasons why it wasn't worth it, because he had to pay for a hotel and that. And that's not, you know. No, he didn't that, say that. He just, yes, he I did on he his show. I, yeah, I did say that on my show. Because guess what? Uh, according to everyone that was at the. The, what hurt the fucking most is when the gig was over. I'm like, hey, where's that house? It's like, and we already talked about it. This is already squats on the BS show. That's why I came in hot on the BS show. That's what hurt me the fucking most is when the whole gig was over. And I'm like, hey, so where's this house? Oh, you're not saying there. It's full. And not like, and just like, peace out, fist bump. Not like, oh, shit, you don't have a place to stay. Let's figure it out. It was more so like, well, too bad. Sorry. Good luck figuring that shit out peace right. that fucking hurt if i did a show in new york city and someone thought they were crashing with me and then it i found out they didn't i at least would have some concern like all right let me see if i can figure something out for you or something i wouldn't be like yep good luck with that shit dude peace no out. i see that i can see and then i, I heard see tony mazar got the fucking room on top of it <laughs> chad's best friend got the fucking room i was supposed to stay in what do you I let tony, they let tony mazar stay in that room yeah tony yeah, mazar got the room when, what what room? Wait a minute. This is all news. According to, me. to Patrick Melton, Pel Patrick Melton no. said the room that Bob didn't crash in. They no. gave it to Tony Mazur. No. no Why do you that. believe everything? That. Why do you believe fucking everything? Why? Mazur Why? had his own hotel room. Yeah, Tony was just hanging out. He had his own thing. He didn't stay there, right? There was, you know what I mean? There was basically every bed and a couch was taken. I left. So that opens up a couch. I, I don't even think about a couch or anything, a floor you could sleep on. What the fuck? It's it's something. You sleep in Ray, car, Ray, you got it. Ray, you I'm got your blanket. New conflict. Good I, got to go. fucking, I got fucking Gino Bisconti, uh, in hot water. Stancil calls me from in hot. I didn't know he was on in hot water. He calls me, <laughs> blindsides me while they're on fucking air. I got Gino screaming at me. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? So I just hang up and then I fucking get into it with Gino. Uh, I could read the text on there. I haven't read them yet, but I have like 97 text messages from. Fucking we don't Gino. care. We don't care. We don't care about any Gino, but any Genos. I don't care. <laughs> I wish I was Kevin Meany, fucking dead right now. Not having to deal with. Oh, this. would you stop it, Ray? Right. It's fucking. It's it's a, it was a gig. Something went wrong. You get old. It just you go on. You move on. You can't. What are you gonna do? Fucking quit comedy because this didn't work. And Ray, Ray, you're right. saying Ray. No offense, but you said you got fucked over. You really didn't get fucked over. I mean, if you didn't have a, if you didn't find a room that night, you would have been fucked over. But yeah. Teamster Tim saved you, so you didn't really get fucked over. Yeah, he didn't know I got it, but no one knew that night that I got a room. I know, but you're saying still, gonna... you're saying still, you got fucked over. But you didn't. Really, in theory, you <clears> could have <throat> been fucked over, but mm -hmm. you didn't. So you ended up uh, Teamster Tim uh, saved you, uh, and then and then so it wasn't a big deal. I still don't know. I still don't understand exactly why. You know, whatever, but it doesn't matter. You guys should have uh, uh, killed a lie the next day. You should have just been like, yeah, I, I stayed at Teamster Tim instead of dragging it out and making He's it like weird. Say that. We already went through that. But He's again, Teamster Tim's not in show business, so he doesn't really know how show business works like with yeah. that. So so you could have just been internet, like, man. you, you could have just told Teamster Tim, like, I'd rather just say I stay with you instead of making up the lie about uh, I got my own room because now people want to because now people want to give me money. I mean, listen, Levy said I, yesterday I, I, on the show, Levy said yesterday on the show, take money out of what you pay me, Kevin, and give it to Ray for the hotel. And what I tell you, what did I say to you, Kevin? What no, did you didn't I tell me you? anything. I texted yes, you I and did. I said, I texted you and I said, do you want me to pay you twice? And I know you didn't stay, you didn't get a hotel, but you want me to pay you twice. I do what I'm told. So Levy said, take the money from him, give it to you. So I said, do you want that money? Yeah, I'll pay you regular, but I'll pay you double if you want. To come what I, say, room. I don't give a shit. What I say, I told you. I said no, you. which is what you should say. But but yeah, but, but you. St I still approached you and said, "What do you want to do?" Because it's not a big deal to me. But yeah. you should have squashed it right away that Sunday night when you did your live stream and be like, you know, you should have talked to Team Stu and be like, "Listen, I'm not comfortable lying because I'm going to get busted. Yeah. I don't want to get. <laughs> I don't want to get fucking. I don't want to be in the Chad Zuma category of just. I have no problem shit. lying. Just no, well, you're a teamster. You're a teamster. Of course, you have you're no problem. To lie. Lie. <laughs> I got that's, no that's problem teamster, lying. That's stuff's rule one hundred and one for teamsters. Yeah. You lie to the cops. You lie to everybody. Yeah. yeah. You, you lie to the hookers. You pick up at the fucking at the restaurant. I don't, I don't you use hookers, Kevin. You lie Kevin, to everybody, Kevin. I don't use hookers, Kevin. 
I'm anymore. Nobody man. does anymore no. after COVID. He's a married man. I do with I fucking Andy. Family. With Andy. Andy, I'm getting a hooker with Andy. Wait, Who's Team Andy? Stu, you don't... I'm Andy. Oh, Jesus. Uh, well, <laughs> <laughs> no, there's so many moving parts of the story. A pink blanket. You had you had yeah. dinner, you had breakfast with with the potato and Mrs. Potato Head. I'm like, what in the fuck is what what is what do potatoes eat for breakfast? Like, who, what the fuck is even happening? Not hash like, browns. Do they stay away from the home fries? I mean, what is no, that rude? If you're a potato, eat a potato. <laughs> I ate, I ate uh, hash browns in front of him. I did he wear? Oh, that's rude. Did he wear the mask? At, yeah, right, yeah, yeah. He was, he was incognito. He yeah. The whole time yeah. he wears a mask. Yeah, no, he was just no. incognito. We couldn't just, we, you know, he had a, he had something over his face. You but know, this yeah. is like a story, like happens when you're on acid. I've never heard anything like. Yeah, that. I know. It's, it, it, it's, dude, Bob. I was pouring orange juice. And every mm -hmm. cup I filled up had a hole in the bottom. So I'm walking over the table with a fucking table full of arms. <laughs> and then th there's a girl that I haven't been with a girl in 30 years. 30 years I have not been alone with a girl. She's sitting there and I can't do nothing right. I'm, I'm going to break that. I'm going to catch a record. <laughs> <laughs> it was a fucking crazy day. And Ray's getting all uptight over dumb shit, man. Like, dude, come on, man. It was like it was hey, the end. It was future, like you killed right? somebody. You, you killed could just somebody call and me and say, hey, Tim, can you, can you Venmo? Ben Mobile, one hundred fifty dollars for a hotel. You could do it to Kevin. You could do it to Bob, or yeah. even Mrs. Levy will fucking Venmo Venmo you the money. So yeah. you're you're okay. You don't have to panic anymore. Yeah, there's no I, panic in. Yeah, but Ray knows that because that time he was going to drive all night to that open mic. Uh, yeah. I said, I said, get a hotel and then drive in the morning. He goes, no, I'll be all right. I'm like, I I, I send him the money anyway. I'm like, here, but get a hotel. Ray, am I lying or no? No, you're not lying. Also, this was all squashed on BS. But the thing is, if we I don't woke... watch BS, <laughs> right. but... I was sleeping. You woke me up, you fuck. I got done working at seven o'clock in the morning. You're calling me at eleven. But who am I? Who am I, Gina? Who am I, Gina Bobina? I just watch podcasts all fucking day. Exactly. I got shit to do. <laughs> but had I known that I wasn't staying at that house. Uh, early in the day Ray, when I called I'm to try to go in the house. Get past it, bro. I'm I, Ray, Ray, Ray. I we don't have time. We don't, was, we don't have time machine. I, was, uh, I, I was upset because I would have got my hotel room and I would have stayed in my hotel room until it was time for me to perform comedy so I didn't have to hang out with 500 people that I'm about to perform for. I, didn't, I don't know. Or you were in the green room. 370 people. Yeah, but you were in the green yeah, room. sitting next to Chad Zumach's best friend, who I assume was there just as snipe stream. Totally, Turns out he totally wasn't. A decent guy. He's a nice guy, yes, yeah. but I didn't know right, that. I just right, watched right. him, said, just watched him in the last two years. About, oh, right, right. Listen, dude. I just watched listen. him for two years. Right. So you would never make it. sign on every fucking... shitty thing Chad Zumach ever said about me. Um, you would never make it on a job site, Ray. You would hang so, yourself on a job site. Yeah, no, right. you turns out he stop. was a nice guy, and he didn't shit on anyone, so that's fine. But like, I'm just sitting there, like, I'm just sitting next to the fucking world, the shittiest person in the world's best friend. Okay, why right. you just move? Why you just change seats? What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> it wasn't yeah, a sign. Was, was it a sign seating? Yes, they were signed fucking seats, like a White House yeah, function. Just, yeah. You got to sit where they tell you to sit. Like, what in the fuck is going you on there, here, Kevin? You don't know. It was fucking. <laughs> no, I've been to venues. I, I know you don't have to sit. You can you can move around if you don't like your seat. No, yeah, people, people were just going around. Some people sat. Some some people just went around in circles and talked to people. I heard Kumia would okay. Uh, Kumia approached you. Yeah, Kumia was cool. We had a good time. He said it was awkward because he he had just been <laughs> shitting on your uh, <laughs> special. Yeah, yeah. Kumia is cool, but Tony Mays is not. But, cool yeah. No, I like yeah. Tony Mays. He was a good guy. He, but he, I didn't know he, he was going to be. But, I didn't know he, he was going to be a good with, guy. He wanted to hang out with Kumia. He shit on you. Tony Mays is shit on you. Don't want to hang out with him. Uh, Ray said, uh, I'm, I'm, I am. I'm, I'm quoting Kumia. I'm quoting Kumia because uh, Kumia said it was kind of awkward when he saw Ray because he goes, he, Ray, Ray, uh, Ray introduced himself or he goes, I'm Ray DeVito. Goes, he goes, you were just shitting on my special for like a half an hour. And uh, he goes, oh, no, you know, I'm just, you know. So Ray goes, well, you know, it's uh, 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 you shitting on my special is actually not as bad as uh, some people liking it. So I'm like, that's total. It's total fucking total cuckery. He's basically saying to 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 Kumia, like, you know, you're you're big enough name that even if you shit on it, that's better than a lesser name saying it's good. I was like, Ray, Ray, you don't have to I always didn't say give, that. That's what he said. You that. said. 
No, he said. And he uh, also said you had a pink blanket. Is that true? <laughs> Don't even bring up the fucking blanket anymore. Adam, please. call this episode "Pink Blanket." Of <laughs> no, course. No, no, no. Yeah, it's we're gonna call all the episodes "Pink Blanket" from now on. <laughs> it's like who has a fucking first of all, Ray? I'll give you fifty dollars. Go to Walmart, get a different color blanket because if you want to get busted carrying around a blanket at a fucking uh, hotel uh, parking lot a Sunday after you have breakfast with the potato and Mr. Potato, have it to have a blue blanket. Don't have a pink blanket. It's it, it, I know they have different colors. Get a blue one or get a re- reversible. So one side gray, pink, one gray or blue. silver, always good. Yeah, get it a looks, neutral I mean, color. It looks like I Kevin Brennan's picture. face. That's what I my uh Yeah, but I would never I buy a blanket the color of my face. <laughs> they would never know he's sleeping next to them. Exactly. They're like, is he naked? They might throw me out with the trash. Man? Is that a naked man sleeping there? <laughs> Who was eating in the bed and dropped a hot dog? <laughs> <laughs> you look like one of those heating pads. One of those pink heating pads. Right. The more I hear, the more I just I almost side with Chad Zumach. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like getting weird, right? I'm sick of this guy's voice. <laughs> <laughs> he might have had a point. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right. So, so have we rehashed that last week? I mean, I, I, you're like in retrospect, and, and nothing happened. And it's you act like yeah. you, you bombed on the Letterman show. And nothing yeah. happened. It's a, it's a non-event. You're like in retrospect, hindsight is 2020. Nothing happened. You had, you had a shit gig. Uh, they've kind of fucked you over, and then Teamster Tim saved the day again, just like that day he had Wi-Fi and he let yeah. you do the show at, <laughs> at your ha- at his house, and his son walked in. We thought you were about to be murdered, or at least uh, uh, knife well, or something. Yeah, I mean, you were just worried. You were like, "What's Tony Mesa doing here?" I go, "He's hanging out," and you're yeah. like, "What? But what is he? Do- what? Who? What do you? Who cares?" He never changed. I anything. said I thought he was there to like fucking. But and why then are you driving letting back, your mind I'm run. sitting there listening to Chad. You know, Tony Mazur was there. He said it was a shit show. <laughs> the whole thing fucking sucked. He's gonna shit on everybody. It's gonna be great. And I was like, if he does shit on everything, that's a dick move. He didn't. He didn't. He was very nice, and he was a. And he so said complimentary wait until things. Somebody about does something before you accuse them of it. Because I, I've seen him sign off on. Shit, Chad made up before, so it's like what that's fuck? what he does. First of all, he's from Ohio. How do you not know him? Right, he's, I, I, he's I from do Ohio. Know, I do know him. I've been nothing but nice to that dude. No, but you act like you don't. You act like you don't know the guy. Like like some guy, Tony Mazer was sitting next to me. You guys are both yeah. from the same fucking town, practically. You're both from Akron or some shit, aren't you? They cut from the same jib. <laughs> what the fuck? What? No, it just... It's How just am I more mad now than I was before? You have nothing... To, right, here's the thing. You didn't... Okay, all you had to do was a spot, right? You weren't headlining. You had nothing... Exactly, nothing so worry. I could have fucking hung out in a hotel room for six hours no, instead of you, sitting there. You, you next... had nothing to worry about. All you had to do was eight to ten minutes, and you it was nothing on you. No matter if you did good or no good, it did not matter t- to the event, really. It would, and would have no not... effect on your career either way. Exactly. Uh, there was no right. talent scouts from SNL. There was nobody there uh, to, 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 to help you or hurt your career. Yeah. I mean, unless Teams to Tim's going to get you a, tr- a truck driving job. No, well, listen. The long game is that we're trying to sign him and Barry Ribs over to the uh, Boliche Boulevard Studios, you know, in, associate, in association with the Attic and Flinch uh, talent agency. <laughs> Wait, you're with you're, you're bo- you're, you're si- Attic is Flinch? Yeah, me, Attic is Flinch, Gladwell Ape. We have a talent agency. It's, all, it's one big conglomerate. And we're trying to, we, we're easy, easily trying to just. Get you over to our camp. So hotel room, Wi-Fi, we got it all for you, right? So we're just, you know, pretty soon we're going to present with a contract. You know, Barry Ribs turned his down. You know, we were two or three uh, sardine cans short of the deal. So uh, Barry Ribs, four ninety nine. Hey, KB, Bob, and Teams to Tim. Great show yesterday. Ray still has. His granny's pink sheet in 1983, <clears throat> almost like America. That's what I thought it was from. I thought it was like a family thing. That's why I mentioned it because. Like, like My Little Pony or something like that? I, I, that's why I thought maybe he didn't want to talk about it. I, all of a sudden, I realized that this blanket. You realized afterwards, after I texted you, you're like, oh, yeah, I didn't even think about that. 
Right, that's a fair now, family. Why, why would I think about a, a pink blanket? What? Right, we that's a family that heirloom that you were that was handed down. The blanket. Uh, I think I got it from my sister's place. So sure. Your sister's daughter, you mean? <laughs> yeah, it's probably theirs. You know when back, teams, back when he used to crash in my <laughs> on my sister's place. He's the only one allowed to. You two can go fuck yourselves. Right. It's called fucking around, man. I'm a truck driver. That's what I do. I fucking talk shit. What am I supposed to do? Back down? No, I said you're the only. No, I said you're the only one allowed to talk shit to me. Let's fucking team up and fucking attack Kevin and Levy. What's up with you two assholes? Wow. Can I say something? Hit the like without button. Kevin, I w- <laughs> without Kevin, I wouldn't have a life today. Okay, can I ask a question now? Okay, say if you didn't think something was going wrong, right? That Hit the like ever, button. Why would you? Why, why would you have a comforter with you on the road? <laughs> because I use it in New York City when no, I was I thought crossing he was my stay at the house. I bring my yeah. pink blanket, but I also okay. like. Yeah, I I use my blanket all the time. If if I crash at Teamsters Tim's place, I have my fucking comforter. It's a comforter. I it was, it was, you know yeah potato comforter. potato potato. It's a fucking pink blanket. All right, Bob. Why'd you say I can say somewhere and turn then it turns out I can't stay there since we're just doing questions. Whoa. Uh, yeah, because I thought you were staying at that. There's a house. We I thought we talked about it on the BS show that there's a house. Don't worry about it. I remember yeah. talking about it. I didn't know what. Well, show turns it was. out I had to worry about it. Right. <laughs> well, you what didn't ask the person in charge. About? You you asked it's me child. who's on the we show. We watched it on BS Day. Who's so I'm never not, I'm in not. any fly. meetings, nothing. I don't do anything but show up to anything that we do. Okay? That's why I don't do shit by myself. Because it's easier for me. <laughs> I brought the same pink fucking blanket. Every story, every story is a sad sack. Even the fucking right. cans in Michigan. You can sell that blanket on eBay right now for probably five hundred dollars. Somebody will buy it. Yeah, more day. than your fucking uh, Barry Bonds, more than the Barry Bonds rookie card. Can we see it at least? I'd like to see this fucking blanket. Johnny yeah. Carson walking around looking like an overgrown <laughs> lioness from the peanuts. Exactly. Exactly right. Hit the like button, everybody. Chad thinks we're buying uh, viewers now, Adam. Yeah, I saw that. We are. It was like a BuzzFeed headline. Is Adam buying viewers? How do you even do that? Oh, there never is. find out. I look. I mean, I looked it up to see if that's what if it was possible because we thought maybe he was doing that. Um, it is possible, but we now, did not. How do, do you that. buy viewers? They don't. You don't. People don't watch it. Just you. Just buy numbers. Higher numbers. Well, I, th- I know you can Three buy women subscribers. Touch this. Ooh. Oh, you can buy subscribers, but you don't yeah, know if you, you can, can buy viewers. I, mean, I think you can, you can buy uh, you can buy any kind of social media thing. I don't but know how where. Do you, but how do you buy the viewers? It doesn't even make sense if they're not watching. How does it? How's it? It just drives mm-hmm. a number up. Yeah, it, it, they're fake. I mean, it's 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 like um, are fake heard people click, watching called, it? So yeah, Johnny, I mean, Johnny basically. Click, they call them click farms in uh, places like Bangladesh. And <laughs> so people know, so we might Thailand. become big in if we buy things, <laughs> we might become big in uh, India and Bangladesh. Not really, because it's fake. So, I mean, analytics wise, yes, but nobody would actually know who the fuck we were. I can already hear, hear Melton trying to book us in a weekend in Bangladesh. <laughs> you guys are blowing up in Bangladesh. It's basically just a way to, to trick. The, I'm uh, not going uh, unless just, I have a hotel room. We got a house. <laughs> the, the Bangladesh Inn. 